Hello and welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving deeper into the history of Burnley Barracks. But before we do that, if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you don't miss out on any of our future explorations. Burnley has a rich military history that many people may not be aware of. One such historical treasure is the Burnley Barracks, a monumental garrison that was erected in the early 19th century. The Burnley Barracks was built in 1821 and was expanded in 1825. It was erected at a cost of £5,500, with a significant part of this amount donated by local landowners and businessmen. However, prior to this, temporary barracks had already been constructed in 1819 at Lane Bridge, and the troops stationed there had been practicing drills in the neighborhood of Croft Street. According to William Varley's diary, there were about 200 troops stationed at the barracks, a combination of both cavalry and infantry. These troops were not only used in Burnley, but they were also dispatched to places like Skipton to suppress any disturbances. Interestingly, the barracks was not always buzzing with the activities of the soldiers. In 1861, except for a sergeant and a librarian, the barracks were momentarily abandoned. It was thought at that time that Burnley would no longer serve as a garrison town. But, by 1865, the troops had returned, although the periods of their stay became increasingly shorter. In 1884, the buildings were finally vacated and were sold around 1897. The barracks was purchased by Ducketts Works in 1913 for £3,000. As time went by, the once magnificent Burnley Barracks was demolished in stages, with the final clearance happening in February 1981 to make way for a car salesroom belonging to Martins Limited. The site of the old barracks became part of Martins Garage, then Lucas Garage, and now houses a modern gym. Burnley Barracks has given its name to Barracks Road and has seen its fair share of history. And it all started with local authorities' decision in 1819 to construct a new prison and station troops in the town after experiencing local disturbances. By 1820, the government offered funds towards a permanent barracks and the site offered by Robert Townley Parker in Burnley was chosen. The barracks was constructed on a ridge close to the Leeds and Liverpool Canal and located between the old and newer roads to Blackburn. The barracks was a complete facility equipped with 36 sleeping rooms, a wash house, two cook houses, a hospital for 16 patients, a reading room, and three wells. The infrastructure underwent more expansion in 1863, with a tender advertised for a two-year project involving a range of building trades. The barracks also had its notable residents, one being Sir James York Scarlett. Scarlett, who rose to prominence in the Crimean War, was a lieutenant colonel in the 5th Dragoon Guards in 1835 when he married Charlotte Hargreaves, a Burnley coal heiress. Thus, Burnley became Scarlett's adopted home, and Burnley Barracks was a significant part of his life here. Today, Burnley Barracks is a part of history, remembered by the town and its people for its remarkable contributions. Thank you for joining us on this journey back in time. If you found this video informative and enjoyable, give us a thumbs up and share it with others who might like it too. Stay tuned for more fascinating historical stories, and don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next video.